Hi, I'm Navid Ansari, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use control rig to aim at something. So we have a character that has a gun in their hand, and we want to aim at stuff, right? So without any further ado, let's begin. First of all, I want to thank my Patreon supporter, and second, I should tell you that this video is part of video series that we download this character, we rig it, we import it, we retarget animations. We use animation blueprint, we use a state machine, cache animation, montages, and all of that to create all of these cool things in Unreal Engine 5. So, now I'm going to talk about control rigs, okay? And control rigs is a very powerful thing in Unreal Engine that you can manipulate the animations, you can do a lot of cool things with it and now i'm going to show you how you can use them so first of all i'm going to go to animation control folder because all the control for animations is in here like animation blueprint right right click in here go to animation and in here choose control rig and it will tell you which blueprint you want to use to create your own control rig and there is just one in here so select it and head create no it created i want to call it cr for control rig and i want to call it dragon aiming okay you can have multiple of them and i will show you how you can use them in your project you can have 10 of them 20 of them right you can do a lot of cool things with them double click on double click on it to open it it opened in this screen so in here first of all i want to bring out our dragon right so first of all go to preview scene in here and for preview mesh select your character doesn't matter which one I'm, I'm gonna use our dragon that we just create together right so next thing to do you should go here to let me make it a little bigger uh, rig hierarchy okay and in here import hierarchy of our mesh and this time again we should use dragon right because we set the mesh in here and this is our dragon right and t pose and if you want to play animation with that you can do it by clicking in here use a specific animation and search for an animation doesn't matter which one it's just for showing you right and right off the bat because we select the animation but it's not showing up there is a problem or bug with unreal engine just save it and again go here and open up the control rig that we just create and again go to preview scene again select here use a specific animation and in here search for idle and choose your animation no the animation is running right so there is a bug in unreal you should close it and then select that right i want to for now i want to put it at default at t pose right doesn't matter we want to add some uh, control rig to our character right so what is the control rig that we want to add to our character the co control rig is something like the bones but with that we can control our character very much easier it easier to click on it it easier to uh, do moving and um, rotating and we can do a lot of cool things with it and it will make our life very much easier we can um, introduce some limitation to the for example hand this is my hand right so the hand can go like this but it can't go like this okay it can't be minus degree in here it can be to for example 127 degree but it can't go minus right the hand can't go like this so with this control leak we can do all of those stuff and we can animate our character as well in here so for testing for showing you some uh, cool things with it we start from a aiming how we can aim our character to the a point right so in here i want to again go to here and select our animation now you can see the 
dragon is just looking forward but let's say uh, the character want to shoot other uh, degrees as well other angles as well right and we don't want always to shoot forward right with this control lick it's easy to do that right so all the hierarchy of the bones in here right so first thing that i'm gonna do i'm gonna collapse all the bones and in here i want to create a new control okay and outside of the uh, hierarchy right it's outside of that so we can control it better because if it's inside the for example pelvis the control itself will be moved with the pelvis so if the control is in the children the child of the uh, pelvis whenever pelvis rotate the control will rotate with that and we don't want something like that we want to just a control to control for example aiming of our character right so we create a, a new control head of two on it and i want to name it aim or whatever you want to call aim at right or whatever you want to call it that's that will be cool and you can see right now it's like this this uh circle and i want to change this the shape of that right know that it's selected if we go here in details panel you can see there is something that is called shape and whatever that is beneath this shape is just for previewing to you right we can change that we can change the shape for example um arrow for tick for example right if i go here hit f you can see it clearly right the, it, this is like this right if you don't want to have it like this you can change the shape to whatever you want i want to change the color for example to green like this no um, no i want to change the size i click in here to change it with together all of them together i think five or six is enough or eight right i think you should decide which one you want to use and i want to rotate it let me rotate this one nothing change <laughs> so let's just put it at zero again i want to rotate this one i don't think that's what i want i want to rotate this one and i think that's cool right no you can see we have this shape it's just a shape right no it does nothing it's just a shape we change the rotation of that shape we change the scale of that shape and we did nothing and what 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 we want to do we wanted this character to look at this to aim for this right to aim for this shape that we put in here we want to aim for that right so i want to put it in here for example for default shape uh, default place default position and know that i put it in here i want to right click on our um, control and tell it to that this is the default position that i always wanted to be here okay by set offset transform from current okay no it will always stuck here so if i change this to here for example and hit compile it will get back that to that default okay now we have this right and i want to bring it in forward of our character at the default i think that's cool so right now it's pointing at that place right again i want to right click in here and set it as default no if i move it wherever i want if i compile it will get back to that place right so no we have a control and we should tell it which bones should follow this control okay and for doing that let me go here you can see in here it's something like blueprint right First of all, I want to get that by dragging and drop it in here, get the control, and you can see it give it the name, the name that we set, it use a global space, and the type of that is control, and it give us the transform, rotation, translation, and a scale, right? So you can see it clearly, we need the transform, right? or translation i will show you which one we want to use so first thing to do i want to use let me open up the or dragon this is our dragon 
and in here I want to show all the bones okay all hierarchy whenever the control is changing its position I want to rotate this bone a spine tree okay I want to rotate that so it's like this and this is my spine tree right when the control go to there the spine tree will move and I look at there and when the control is over there my spine tree will rotate my body to that mm, location or position right so we need a spine tree so for doing that we should drag and drop from here and search for aim and there is a node for aim right this is our aim and it will it, 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 it will tell you which bone you want to manipulate by this control that we get in here right so in here the bone that i want to use is a spine tree right so you can see it's mess up our character let's just go to character bones and click none and you can see it it's the reason that it's um, mess up our character i will show you it's all about this axis okay the primary axis and the secondary axis right so the primary axis is forward vector and the secondary axis is up vector so we should get that if we go to our dragon and if we go to our skeleton in here go to character and show all the bones or not let's just select on a spine tree head w on your keyboard so now you can see in a spine tree the forward vector is let me again click on it a spine tree the forward vector is z and you can see the blue is z so the forward vector is z right so let's just go back in here the forward vector is z it means in here in the axis in primary axis that is forward vector the z should be one and all the other should be zero okay so this was for the forward vector or primary axis both of them are the same no the target the target that we want our character to look at or rotate toward it okay is the forward vector or primary target forward vector or primary target this primary is forward forward of our character right so we should set this target with this translation right into target okay now you can see it's rotating and the uh, again it um, it mess up our character but if we go here in this kind for our secondary target if we change it to direction and again you can see our character is bending like this that the reason is that we the default setting for this target is 100 we should change them to 000 okay now you can see everything is cool and we can change and the character is um, following our uh, control you can see it clearly we can use this on our character we use it with animation blueprint we can use it everywhere we can just create animation with it and we can dynamically move it with our mouse as well and you can see everything is looking beautiful everything working cool so in the next video i will show you how you can control this uh, control with your mouse or where or where our player want to shoot at right so that was it guys for this video i hope you like it please 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 if you want to help me and you like this video hit that like button and subscribe to my channel it's my honor to have you here thank you thank you thank you very much for watching bye